So today we're going to be going over uh, screen capture and audio and also being able to convert the file format from .ogv from the screen capture on Ubuntu to uh, .avi so you can post your videos and tutorials on YouTube. Here we go. Go down to Applications, click Ubuntu Software Center, <clears throat> then come over to the search box, type in gtk record my desktop when it comes up you'll click the right arrow here and you'll click add or install excuse me it'll say install and then it'll give a progress bar over here we're gonna also install another program so click get free software and type in winff same process click the right arrow click install now you'll see the process here for the progress click install put in your password click authenticate I'm gonna pause download now that it's complete it'll come to the WinFF screen you can basically just X out of this now with both programs installed you'll come down here to applications sound and video click your GTK record my desktop now you're gonna to want to make sure sound quality is checked you're gonna save it beforehand so it knows what to save it as we'll just save it as test make it on the desktop click save then we're gonna click record and start recording now to stop it, it stopped, click OK. We'll close out, it gave me problems because we already have one open here. But essentially, I'll stop this video and then uh, redo the one that I have going so we can convert it to WinFF, here we go. Now that we have our video here, uh, I changed it to YTVid just for YouTube vid. Now that we have our video here, we're gonna go to Applications, Sound and Video, WinFF. We're going to add this file this file here, YouTube vid. Click add, go to desktop, then we'll go to YouTube vid, click open. We're going to change it to an AVI file, device preset of full screen, and we'll send it to the desktop. Click convert. This will start running here in a terminal box. Then it'll be done in just a minute. Here, I'll pause it. When the conversion is completed here, you'll see you press enter to continue to exit the terminal. And we'll X out of this. And here you see we have our ytvid.avi created. Um, and it'll actually open up and play just as an AVI. And you'll be able to upload your tutorial to YouTube. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please post. Now when I completed this YT vid, I actually had a problem since I had to stop and go back in and do it again. I had to open GTK record my desktop again, which actually created two files. As you can see, I have ytvid.ogv and then I have the second portion, WinFF convert. Uh, that's when I stopped there, which gave me a problem. I had two files. I converted them both to AVI, but I still had two files. As you can see up above here, I have WinFF convert.avi and below ytvid.avi. Now to get these in one video, uh, here I have them as completevideos.avi, I actually use a terminal to convert them to two videos. Now here's how it was done. So I went to a terminal and first thing I did was cd to desktop because my files are located on the desktop. Then I input the command <clears throat> sudo apt get install mencoder, if you need this just pause the video here. And when you hit enter it'll say that I already have the latest or newest version. But then after that, you type mencoder dash OVC space copy dash OAC space copy space. Now, ytvid.evi is the first video you want. So when you do it, you'll put in the first video and then space WinFF convert. Here, I'll move the, the screen over a little bit. I'm freezing. WinFF convert.avi, that's my second video. So you have the first video, ytvid.avi, then the second video, WinFF convert.avi dash O space, and then you put in the title of your new video and make sure you put the file extension.avi on it. And when you hit enter, it'll actually, I'm going to change this to complete videos two. It doesn't matter that I messed up there, just so it's different than the first one. This will actually convert, and as you see here, it gave me a complete .avi file so I converted two .avi's into one in sequential order so they can be uploaded to YouTube if you have any further questions on this make sure you hit